So the interest of the, of the people of the Azam region is economic. Economic number one, peace and security number two, and three, national unity. I believe by us getting together, these issues can be achieved. And this is why these two groups are unique. The people of the Mount are very resilient people, very enterprising people, highly educated. And to some extent, in certain quarters, among the leading entrepreneurs in Kenya. When I see Mr. Munga here, I only don't see the chairman of uh, the Mount Kenya Foundation, but I also see a serious entrepreneur who has changed the lives, not only in Kenya here, but in the, in the entire region. Uh, by the way, with due respect to the diplomatic norms, equity can qualify as a mini state in certain quarters. And I believe this is why His Excellency the President, for the first time in the history of Kenya, and for those of you who are avid readers of our, our foreign policy, His Excellency the President immediately was elected in 2013. One of the first things that he did was to domesticate and actualize our foreign policy into a written document. If you Google the Minister of Foreign Affairs, I'm sure number one that says no. The first pillar is economic diplomacy. You need to ask yourself. Some will say the President is a businessman. Some will say the President is a businessman. No, it is because what counts in the world of today is not political ideology. It's economic strength. This is why the combined efforts. We have the land. Let me tell you the secret. We in the Asal region, from the Asal region, we have the land. 70% of the land mass of the Republic of Kenya comes from that part. You have the resources. If we combine, and you give us avenues to invest. Uh, yes, we are in the process of making history. This country is in a transition. This country is going to be a peaceful handover of power. We've had one of the greatest presidents that has ever transited in this country and also the region. We from his corner, this region that we are referring to, we belong to his corner. We are his people. We trust him. He has given us an opportunity. And whatever direction that is going to give us is the direction that we are going to follow. It doesn't matter whether he's not going to be a presidential candidate, and he is not. But we want to go with him. We want to be by his side. And I know sometimes there are some, although it's dying down now, there are some discordant voices also from your region as North, as North Kenya. We are inviting you back to where we are. We are inviting you back to where we are. Make sure that nobody is left behind. Because the legacy of President Uru Kenyatta, the people are going to protect the legacy of this of Uru Kenyatta. It can only be a chosen successor by himself. And that is where the direction we want to go. He has given us his dreams and vision for this country has been very clear. That's why you see he's blind to whoever he gives opportunity. That's why some of us, because of his own decision, he trusts, us, he trusts us with the past of this country. Because he knows we are Kenyan, because he knows that we can make a difference. And that's the direction we want to go. I want to wish you well. Afkiri tofauti. Sisi kama jamii ya sehemu hii county kumi kutoka Lamu paka Turkana tumekuwa na mawasiliano si siku moja tumekuwa na mawasiliano ya zaidi ya mwezi tatu tumechambuana na tumejua nani hapo na sisi na tumetengeneza critical mass 80% of our elected leaders are in this room we want we want to teach you we want to liberate you from Wacheni mambo ya mama moja tumoe wili watatu wanne so that tujaze tujaze population ndo tushikane pamoja tuunde serikali we will receive each other at the table as equals and we will open the door together and walk in that door together as equals as equal partners we have more to give you have more to give we have more to share and we will share that and that is a political direction that we're going to be taking together. 
It is very important that we know each other more than we do. Today, we are here to, to discuss those issues that are common to us because we have a common heritage. And there are certain things that we need to do together. We need to agree on so that we can live in harmony. As we have always been known as very peaceful communities around the mountain. Here too, and during the colonial days, our brothers in northern Mount Kenya, North Mount Kenya, were known as coming from the frontier district. But the independents, again, in recent times, they are no longer saying that they are going to Kenya when they are coming to Nairobi and other parts of Kenya. Because they know they also belong to Kenya. Because they no longer say that they are marginalized. The third highest position in the governance of Kenya is the Minister for Finance. And it comes from no other place than what used to be called Northern Frontiers. How would you therefore say that they are marginalized? He holds the past. He keeps the past. He maungano ambaye tumeungana hapa leo ni wimu sana na tunapenda idumu yende lakini vile vile waziri achukue jukumu pia kwa sababu anaifahamu sehemu zetu kule chini northern kenya hapa eastern tuna tatizo nyingi sana ndani yetu wenyewe ni muhimu sana kushirikiana na kutafuta amani kwa sababu tumeshirikiana hapa juu kwa sababu ya amani na amani lazima ipatikane hata kule chini mashinani kama hakuna amani kule mashinani basi hata ya hapa haitawezekana kwa hivyo mimi nauliza waziri wetu vile amefanya juhudi na akatia bidii tunamuuliza afanye bidii kuweza kuunganisha watu hata kule mashinani naona watu ya mountain wameshikwa na hamasa wanapiga ngoma ya kiasili ambaye mchezaji hajulikani anatoka wapi naohakikishia kwamba hii serikali mwelekeo ikiharibika kwanza ni haribiki ya mlima na wale wanafuata ni watu wa northern kenya tutakuwa yatima tutakuwa yatima na tunataka tusimame na rais uhuru muige kinyata yeye ndio kiongozi wetu yeye ya pale anasema huko huko ndio bahali ya faida maana sisi wakati ya zamani wale wazee wetu wakati walikuwa wanataka kutuambia hatutaki Somalia walisema kile kitu kizuri inatoka north upande huu east, east. ni jua peke yake hakuna mtu mzuri anatoka huko tunataka tukae pamoja na tuelewe hivyo thank you very much